And this is my HP tablet. It's um, 32 gigs. I actually um, was blessed enough to be able to upgrade um, to a 32 gig tablet. I originally had the um, 16 gig, upgraded to 32 gig, believing that, of course, I would get more internal space and didn't realize that everything came down to how the ROMs uh, separated the internal memory. So of course I get the 32 gig, I put you know a ROM on there. Right now I have the uh, fat and creamy ROM on there because it's very important for me to be able to stream and right now you can only stream video up to 4.0.4. So it's a 4.0.4 ROM, and uh, I like it. It's decent. Um, and so ultimately what I ran into is a space issue. I have, um, oops, that was accidental. I have a tremendous um, amount of apps. I actually have 327 apps. This is just what I have on my uh, home screen and then of course this is what's in my app drawer. And uh, another thing that's happening when I go to install my apps is that um, some of them automatically go to the SD card. Now naturally um, I've just found out recently been having problems with that because I have so many apps that you can only put 50, call, 50 apps on the SD card. So I had to go get the 50 biggest ones, but the app to SD program, which is actually really great, um, it's right here. Um, it organizes them in biggest to smallest. So when you tap it, everything listed, I was telling me to clear space, I always clear space. They, you see the first one there, the Dolphins 29, or, okay, those are gone. So 19, 19, 18, 18, 17, 17, 16. So it's a really smart, you know, um, program because it labels the largest ones first. So what I did was take the 50 largest apps I had and moved to my SD card to give me more space. Um, but then the problem that I started having wasn't my internal memory. It was my, the ability that I have to put the apps on my SD card. So I searched and searched and searched and I found a tweak. Um, I actually found a tweak that's out there that allows you to have more internal memory and it gives it to you um, in a thousand megabytes and a two thousand megabyte unit. And you can add that. It's a zip file. I could actually show it to you um, here. Um, go into my downloads. And it's a zip file. It's these. Here, they won't come in clear for you. I'm trying to get them to show. Okay, that's as clear as I can get it. But it's the Tenderloin update, and they're saying Data Plus. Um, and then if you don't have the SD card check, that's actually built into my ROM, so I didn't need it. And what it does is, if you ever by chance get more than 50 apps on your SD card, it will cause your um, SD card to disappear because it's overloaded. And so actually what you do is you can reboot your device. Um, it'll be a little message down here. It'll be like a little SD looking card thing. And it'll be gray and it'll say SD card removed, please insert another one. And basically when you, if you don't have this, then you'll have to download this to your device and then go into your recovery and run it. And, um, and install the zip and that way when you go to reboot it forces your SD card to do a check again and it shows back up. Um, but then the only thing that I could do at that point would be to take the apps and move them back to my internal memory from my SD card. But with this tweak 
this data plus tweak here, I got the 200, 2048 megabyte one. And that actually uh, gave me another 2048 megabytes in my internal memory. So I went from 1.48 internal, which I can show you so you can see for yourself. Um, I went from 1. Point, let's go to storage here. We're going to hit storage. And I went from, I don't know if you can see that number, should be coming up. But it usually says 1.48 gigs, and it says 3.45 gigs of internal. So that also means that I don't have to move as many apps. And now, see, I have 2.41 gigs free. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I'd like to keep about 40 apps over. I've been trying to do like 45, but what happens is sometimes I just kind of get on a, a, a app overload and I'll download five or six apps at a time just to test them out and then I find that my SD card disappeared so I'm going to go down from 45 apps in the way of course you know you know that as you go into your app and you can see what's on the SD card and all of these little checks over here are the ones that are on the SD card the other ones are the ones that were on the SD card and are no longer there but they're in the history so I scroll and I just count my checks and when I count my checks, I know how many apps I have on my SD card. Um, but what's most important is the size of the apps. And so everything that's over 20 megabytes is usually what I have on my SD card. Some of these are listed, they're not over 20 megabytes, um, but they were, like these are the ones that when you install them, they automatically go on, and so I had to move them back away and they're just here in the history. Only the ones with the checks um, are on my SD card. So I have to make sure I only have 40 checks. That way I don't keep running into that, you know, you removed your SD card, put another one in. And I still have quite a bit of memory on my SD card uh, left. I got six gigs. I mean, we're talking about 32 gigs. It has the web OS, it has the Windows, I have, uh, you know, um, a lot, a lot of apps. That's what I got this tablet for. My tablet is strictly for fun, it's for games, it's for video watching, um, and I practically burned my first one up. Um, I fixed it, but I burned it up, you know, playing with it. I mean, these are all the games that I have on here. And then these are all the apps that I use to run my system. And then this is another page of games that's quickly filling up. Um, so uh, that is my little known information. It's out there, but you really got to search for it. So I just kind of wanted to tell people um, who didn't know that there is a way to give yourself more internal memory. And I believe that you can do this multiple times. So you can make it like a phone where you can have six or eight gigs of internal memory every time you run that zip file. Um, it gives you, it's just a program that tells it to add more space. Every time you run this little one here, it's going to tell your um, tablet to add more space to it. So um, to my knowledge, that's how it works. Uh, and that was something that I really needed. It helped me because, um, you know, I got all of these gigs and, you know, got all these games I want to get. And, you know, after 300 or so, I was maxed out. So now I got like 360 or 370 apps and I'm still going strong. All right. Hope it helps someone.